Merry Christmas everyone! Even though this is after Christmas, Merry Christmas! I uploaded a vlog before this video about how I was in Tennessee all of the first week of winter break and now today is New Year's Day and Happy New Year to everyone and it's the start of 2014 which is the year I graduate and I'm just so excited. So excited. Today I'm going to be doing a big collective haul. It's not what I got for Christmas because that's going to be my next video. It's what I have accumulated throughout the month of December I guess you could say it like that. It's stuff that I got on my trip to Tennessee, like during the trip, stuff like I got before, stuff like I got after with Christmas money, just that kind of thing. Here's my little snowman, which is kind of, oh, okay, there you go, you have an eye. Um, he's out every day, actually. He sits like right next to my bed. First, I'm just gonna start off with two simple things that I got off of Amazon about three weeks ago. I got this case, which is, whoa, I'm gonna blind you guys. It's the life proof case, but it's not the life proof case. Like it doesn't have the label down here. And it is such an awesome case. I only paid $8 for this and it is waterproof. It is shockproof. It is everything. I take it in the shower. I play music in the shower. I took it snowing and I dropped it in the snow. I took it snowing. What? I took it in the snow and I dropped it in the snow and it was fine. Like my friends threw it across the room and it was fine. If you guys want the link to this case, it will be down below. I think it's so good because life proof cases are around $80 and I just paid eight for this one. So I love this thing and it's my favorite color. So yeah, it, I'll leave it down there. And the next thing that I got for my iPhone, I have the iPhone 5 by the way. Um, I got a simple bumper for my phone. It's clear and then it has pink borders on it. Um, the details are silver and it's just a simple iPhone bumper and I'm just gonna use this if I take my life proof case off. Next I'll just probably start off with what I bought in Tennessee which is like the really big stuff I guess. I'm not gonna go in any specific order. I'm just gonna go through what I got. So I got this little guy in the Christmas Palace in Pigeon Forge. I love stuffed animals hence stuffed animals like everywhere. And it says Great Smoky Mountains on the hoodie and it's a bright pink hoodie and he is, or he, she, she, I think it's a girl. She has a pink hoodie, so. Girl, um, she's so cute and I took her to Knoxville with me on Christmas day and I took pictures with her and I actually Instagrammed a picture of her and I was like my new travel buddy and she was singing with me in the car like I love her. She is the cutest little thing. So I went to the Disney store. I'm such a child, but whatever. One of my favorite Disney movies or movies overall has had to be Monsters, Inc. I watched it the day it came out when I was like six or something. I think it came out when I was like six. And I'm still that person that hasn't watched Monsters University though and I need to watch that. But I saw this and I cried. It is Boo. I love Boo. Boo is the cutest little thing. I love her like... I wanted to be Boo when I was younger. I don't know why. I wanted to have this costume for Halloween. I don't know. Next thing that I got in Pigeon Forge is something that I have been collecting since I saw the first one. I really like the store Kirkland's. It's like a home store and I've really been obsessing over owls lately. So I got myself this little owl. I have the three of them. There's this one. They're actually sitting right there. They're all Christmas owls, but I'm going to keep them out throughout the year because they're the cutest little things. This one has like a little birdhouse on it. The other one has a candy cane on this arm and then the other one has a Christmas tree on this arm. So they're all white and they're super cute. And I have the three of them from the line and I just got the last one that I needed. So she's so cute. So about an hour away from Pigeon Forge in Gatlinburg, there's this town called Cherokee. It's all Cherokee Indians and the Minnetonka um, moccasins come from there and they make them there and everything. And in Pigeon Forge, they have one of those stores. And I love moccasins. They are so cute. They are so comfortable. And I saw this and I was like, hmm, that's a really tiny baby shoe. Turns out it's a keychain. So I'm gonna show you guys it. This is probably gonna go in my car because I don't wanna ruin it, but on my key, on my keys. It's a little 
moccasin and it's so cute it is the same kind of moccasin that I have and it is so cute next thing that I got at the outlet was this beanie that I really like because I really like beanies and it's just this striped beanie you can wear it with anything and I really like it so I just got myself a simple beanie I went to Walgreens which is in Gatlinburg where I was staying and I really wanted to try out a new chapstick and I'm obsessed with pomegranates so I saw this it's the Burt's Bees replenishing lip balm with pomegranate oil and it's 100% natural and I just got this and it smells really good the only thing is that when you like lick your lips it doesn't taste its best but it's really good for your lips and it leaves my lips super soft so I've been using this one in my US a lot but I just got this one and I really like it so yeah next thing that I got I am super excited for it this is gonna be my next first impressions video I got the voluminous butterfly in blackest black it is the waterproof version I have heard so much about this mascara everyone raves about it um, Bethany from Mac Barbie 07 talks about it a lot so I just needed to try it because mascaras are my favorite things so I just got this one and I haven't opened it. I love candles. You guys probably know that I'm obsessed with candles. I will probably talk about candles later because I bought some candles. More candles. And I walked into this candle shop and they had so many candles. I got this little one. They are two owls and I'm not gonna burn this because it is so cute. And yeah, they're just two little brown owls on a tree branch. And then I got this little guy. He's so cute. <laughs> It's a little mouse with a poinsettia in his hands and it's so cute. It has like really chubby cheeks and it is adorable. And I got this one over there too and obviously I'm not gonna burn them. I'm just gonna save them. I also have a Scentsy warmer in my bathroom. I used to have it in my room but I put it in the bathroom. And I love the wax blocks or wax melts that you put in there. So I saw a few and I was like, oh, let me just get some. So I just got these two and they smell so good. They smell really good and I can't wait to put these in my Scentsy Warmer. Converse are my favorite shoes. I got $100 for my parents for Christmas. So I was like, hmm, what am I gonna use $100 on? Of course they take me to the Converse store in the outlets and I go crazy. So Converse, woo. My box is like destroyed because I put it in the car and everything, but I had never seen Converse like these. They are beautiful, I think. Um, everyone is entitled to their own opinion, but I love these shoes. They are high top Converse. These are actual leather Converse. I might buy some other colored laces though so I can switch these and wear them with other stuff. They are so pretty, they're high tops and I love these shoes and I'm so excited to wear them with like jeans and leggings and everything so I just got these. Next things that I got were just some laces. I need black laces for my high top converse and I might use the, these with those too. Um, and then I just got these black and white laces for my black and white converse and these were actually ooh, on sale for 50 cents and I was like oh getting them. So I got these and then I just got these for my high tops. I got some socks. They are, um, what are they? High, high socks? Yeah, they're like the really high socks. Well, not high socks. They're like mid calf, I guess. And they're just this like mix of black and white um, knit with a light fuchsia color at the top. And then I just got these black ones with the same fuchsia on the top. And they are so pretty. And I got these for five bucks, which wasn't bad at all. So yeah, I'm excited to wear these with like my black and white Converse and maybe even for soccer. I actually got this on Monday, the day I got back from Tennessee. Victoria's Secret was having their seven for 26 panties sale. So I kind of went crazy. And sorry if I'm showing you guys underwear. It's underwear, woo. I just got this lacy black underwear, blue with like um, silver like polka dots on it. And it has lace all around it. This blue one, and there's just lace all across the top and the back. This really colorful one, and I think it's so cute. I got this one, and then I got this one, which I really like because I like black and white and pink, and it matches my room, but it's underwear, so yeah. 
Um, it's this black and white polka dot one with two bows right here. It has black and white hearts? What? Flowers on the back and it's super cute and I just got this one. This light purple one with neon green polka dots all over it and all over the back. One thing I have on which is a yellow underwear with lace on the sides because it's been this Wayland tradition to wear yellow underwear for New Year's so we're wearing one today. So that's what I got at Victoria's Secret. It wasn't too much but I mean it was 7 for 26 so I was like go. And then the last thing, Bath and Body Works. I got a $50 gift card from Cynthia, so thank you Cynthia for my gift card. I haven't used the whole thing, which I'm very proud of. Um, mahogany teakwood is my favorite scent from Bath and Body Works, so I just got two of the mahogany teakwood scent portables for my car, because I actually have to switch it out, so I just got two of these since they're my favorites, and yeah, they were two for five, so I just got that. Then, I wanted to get the big one, but I couldn't find it, so I just got the little one, or the medium one. It's the black tie uh, candle from Bath and Body Works. It smells like men. So good. This one, flannel and mahogany teakwood. Y'all smell really good. Your perfect escort to any holiday party, green sage, sandalwood, and tonka bean. It smells really good, and I really recommend it. And the top is really pretty, too. And then the last thing I got was the Bellini Cafe candle. This smells so good. It does not smell like coffee at all. It just smells like... The description, let me just see that. The Italian love of life is captured in a blend of sparkling berries, juicy apple and sugared grape notes. Bellissimo. It does not smell like coffee at all. It smells like fruits. It is so good. You should totally go smell it. And they have their semi-annual sale this week or actually for like the next month, I think. So I totally recommend going to check that out. My second video of 2014, woo! I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I hope you guys had wonderful holidays and spent time with your family and everything. And thank you guys so much for sticking with me since I started YouTube back in July. And I can't believe it's been six months and time, uh, time flies by. I hope you guys keep watching my videos and I love all of you guys. Have a great day and I will see you guys again soon. Bye, guys.